Hello and welcome everyone. In today's lesson, I will be doing with consumption. So, consumption is the seventh part of speech. So, we will see the definition of consumption. Consumption are words that are used to join two words or sentences. So, conjunction are words that are used to join two words or sentences. In English grammar, we connect these words and sentences by using conjunction. So, we will see the examples. My mother loves me and take care of me take care of me so my mother loves me is a different sentence and take care of me is different sentence and it is joined by the consumption and so and is the consumption word so another example i want to go play but I am sick. So in this sentence, I want to go to play but I am sick. So I want to go to school is a first sentence. And I am sick is second. So it is joined by the conjunction word but. So and but are the conjunction words. So we will see uh, mostly common used conjunction words. So there are many conjunction words in English but the most commonly uh, used conjunction is and. So we will see the uses of and as a conjunction word. We use and to connect similar ideas or to add information. So we will see with the examples. Aman is going to school. Ram is going to school. So we see the two different sentences. Aman is going to school. Ram is going to school. So Aman and Ram are the two different words. Aman and Ram are the two different words but what they are doing is going to school. The idea is similar. So we will use and when the ideas are similar, we will use and. So we have to write this sentence. Aman and Ram are going to school. 
So Amal and Ram. So conjunction is a joining word. It joins two words. So Amal and Ram are two different words. It is joined by and and going to school is the similar idea. So we have written are going to school is number one example. So we will see another example. So another example is my mother loves me. My mother take cares of me. So care of me. So your my mother and my mother is the same word. My mother and my mother. So loves me and take care of me is the two different qualities she does. So while joining we will write my mother loves me and care of me. So we use the conjunction word and to join the to add information that my mother is doing. So she loves me and takes care of me. So it is joining and adding information also in this sentence. So the second conjunction word is but. So when do we use the conjunction word but? Let's see. We use but to show a difference or an opposite in a contrasting ideas. So for example, we will see Mr. Khan is strict. Mr. Khan is honest. So there is two different sentences. One sentence and the second sentence. The word Mr. Khan, Mr. Khan is say. So the word Mr. Khan and Mr. Khan is say. But the idea Mr. Khan is having is different. When we have two different ideas, we use but, the conjunction but to join the sentence. So it can be uh, easy to write and read. So my is strict but honest. So to make this two sentence connect, to connect this two sentence we have used but, the conjunction word but to join this two sentence. So number three, the conjunction word or. So when do we use the conjunction word or let's see with examples. Is it Thursday or Friday today? We use or to show a choice between two ideas or things. So in this sentence, is it Thursday or Friday today? So we are asking, is it Thursday or Friday? So Thursday and Friday are the two opposite things. It is asked. So we use or to connect Thursday and Friday. For another example, what would you prefer? To eat, oh sorry, drink tea or coffee. So we uh, use conjunction or would you prefer coffee or tea? So in the sentence, would you prefer coffee or tea? So it is showing option. So or is used when we show an option. So in this sentence, would you prefer coffee or tea? 
is sewing and option so or is used when we uh, when we say when we use uh, it is used when if we show options So we see the, another conjunction word, the uses of conjunction word because with examples, Raju can't play because he is sick. So we use because to show or explain the reason. So because in the sentence Raju can't play because he is sick. So Raju is sick that's why he can't play. So because is used when uh, we show the reason. When we uh, show the reason because the conjunction word because is used. So number five conjunction word is if. So we will see the uses of if as a conjunction. We use if to join sentences which show that a condition has to be fulfilled for something to take place. So let's understand this with examples. You will pass if you work hard. So in the sentence, you will pass if you work hard. So is the different idea. You will pass if you work hard. So you will pass we have used if to connect this to different ideas. We have used this conjunction if. If you will do that, you will pass. If you will do that, then it will, uh, you will score good marks. So if is used when uh, to show that a condition has to be fulfilled. So another number six conjunction word is not. We use not to show an alternative negative idea. For example, Rhea is actress, nor see. So here, Rhea is not an actress. So she is not an actress. So not is representing negative. No. So it is, uh, it shows the negative idea. So she is not an actress, nor she dance well. So she cannot dance and she is not an actress. So this uh, conjunction word not is used when we show the alternative negative ideas. So I explained to you the most commonly used conjunction words and I just want you to note down this chart so for their better understanding.